Well, we get home today, guess what's all piled up on the front porch? Two boat seats for the Contiki. That's good news. Hey honey, can you get me another beer? <laughs> I was just going to ask. Huh? I was just going to ask if you wanted one. Yeah, I'm sorry, I should have. No, it's fine. These things will go in pretty slick. What? These are going in pretty slick. Not much to it. Good. Put the little uh, studs in. Pretty, nice little plastic base here they send. And that actually just screws down to the deck. And then you take your back and screw your studs in. And this goes in these little slots. And uh, you take a wing nut and a washer and a lock washer. And find your stud. Like that. Tighten them down. Four of those. We'll get those in. Once you get that back screwed on, it's still floating. But you take your bottom and that's a couple of little hinges. Screw in right here. And screw those on. Yeah, if I can do that with right in my neck. Turn your screw right in. It's real simple. Hopefully you can see that. Just one, two, three, four screws. Tighten them down. case I've removed the armrest because they were too far gone I'm probably just gonna buy some um, down the road but for now I'll get by without them plus it's kind of wet down in there I'd like for it to dry out so it doesn't rot um, you get this where you want it eventually where it was that. And you put the screws to the bottom One, two, three. These have little drain holes in here. Anyway. Little drain holes so it can't go anywhere. Let's see. Like that. And we're good to go. New seat. Yes, sir. Not too shabby. And the other thing I want to do, 
killed that hornet. I did. Uh, I have four screws I took out of the back. What do they do with them? As usual, I don't have them. What you do is you put back here two screws in the back to hold the top. Like so. a new seat. How about that? My God. Pretty comfortable, actually. Alright, two more to go. Just for the record, we do have Prince Albert in a can. Probably had to let him out, huh? God, these things are nasty. Get rid of these. And... It's rotted, but it's not long. Get the screws out. Just the hell out of here. Oh my god. I'll tell you what. Good for the money. Okay, we're gonna to attempt to put on a new bimini top. Is it bimini? Bimini bimini. Bimini bimini. Bimini. <laughs> bimini. Oh. <laughs> Depends on your geographical vernacular. But a bikini top. See how that's gonna go. It actually does look like it's gonna fit though. Stay tuned. Even has the hole for the light. Yes, which is huge. Yes. Okay, let's see if we can get the bikini top to go up. <laughs> I will absolutely come. Something's not attached back there. Uh, oh. Um, bring, hold that. What appears are missing four rods, or three actually, They're like little downriggers. And I see now what those other brackets are for. They, uh, get two in the back, two in the front, and that's what I'm missing. So, I'll do whatever I get to do, I guess, to find those. Or I can make some, it's just the square stock, aluminum stock, that's pretty easy to come by and get some pins. No big deal. Just easier when you see the picture what it's supposed to look like. So, Alright. Well, no big deal. At least the, the bimini top fits. That's all that really matters. So, get rid of that mold and mildew back there. That's that's, that's a big plus, even if it never goes up. Alright. What are we getting there? Another base for that. Um, get that old mildew rotted out plywood out of here. Yeah, it's coming right along. Yeah, these seats are pretty... They go in quick and easy. They're a uh, nice plastic base. Um, 
you know, for, I think it's a couple hundred bucks a piece, really, for the base and the seat. So you figure that's not, you know, you couldn't get them reupholstered for that, that's for sure. Plus, you're getting rid of those old rotted out bases, too. The, the, the decking on this thing is, is perfect. I mean, it's not rotted at all, but the seats, some of the uh, seat bases were kind of in pretty sad shape, so. Whatever. We'll, uh, we'll get rid of that, and then um, one step closer going in the water, I guess. Yeah. You served well. Time has come.